three dice. They look quite normal, but they're actually they're far from it. There's some very strange parroting going on, which I knew nothing about until really quite recently. If I place them like this, they've got the six on the bottom and the, and the, the opposite side that up to seven. Turn each one round. I'll try that one there. I'll turn the outer one like this. So why should the middle one be different and do that? Well, there's something very strange going on here, parity. Looking straight down like this, this has got those four other pieces, the three, five, the two and the four, in a certain order, and this one simply reverses the order. So there, I thought that any dice would be, have to be completely symmetrical, provided the reverse got the opposite sides adding up to seven, but this turns out it's not the case. There's another sequence of parity which allows you to do various tricks, which people don't know about this, can do something that's magical, having a pair of dice and asking your victim and your, your audience to do the, exactly the same move as you do, and for some reason or other it doesn't work. And they don't realise how it is it's happening. It's due to parity. Those two are not actually identical pieces. These ones, outer ones, are completely identical in every way, but the, outer, the other ones is a, is a mystery one. It's one that goes from a different sequence, looking round the sides of the thing. Mm. And the subject of many clever tricks by magicians.